So one of the tweets that got the best response was, uh, why are both stock market and gold so high? The reasons I gave is because the US dollar is dying. Problems with CMBS, commercial back mortgage securities, that's like the subprime stuff of 10 years ago. I mean, uh, office buildings, shopping malls, and hotels are now broke. They can't pay their mortgages on the biggest shopping centers and office buildings, hotels, cruise ships, airlines, and CLO collateralized loan obligations. What a CLO is, is a subprime loan. You know, back in 2008, they were lending people without any job, without a job. They were lending them as much as they wanted to buy a house. Well, a CLO is the same thing, but it's loaned to a CEO whose business is broke. So these CLOs, they're huge. They're bigger than lending to subprime people without jobs. So let me give you a little background how I understand all this. Uh, my life changed when I read this book here. It's called The Grunge of Giants by Dr. R. Buckman's Fuller. Very simple book. But grunt stands for gross universal cash flows. And it's how people like the central bank, Wall Street, the US Treasury, and the ultra rich rip us off via our money and the education system. So this was in 83 and my life changed. So that when I when I talk about the US dollar is dying, I kind of know what I'm talking about. And then this book here came along, but I don't know, 94 and it's called The Creature from Jekyll Island by um, G. Edward Griffin. As you can tell, I sucked at school, but I do study, and I've been a student of monetary policy. And the other person I study is my friend James Records, it's Currency Wars. We get f via our money. You know, America is fighting war with China and Japan and all this stuff via our money. And then I wrote this book here, Prophecy, I said the biggest crash was coming. But anyway, I was, I was off by a few years. It came in 2020 because I understand money. And the other book I think is crucial to understand why they're not just tweets. It's the road to ruin, again, by James Records. This guy is with the CIA, he's with the Defense Department, and he's with LTCM, Long-Term Capital Management. This guy knows what he's talking about. He's a friend of mine. So when I say because the dollar is dying, I'm just not BSing you. Yeah, I am a student of it. And, and it, it, it goes all the way back to the original, not the original, but the book I read, wrote, read here is called The Grudge of Giants. Grudge, gross, universal, cash. So that's how I know the uh, dollar is dying. The stock market is way high and gold is high, they shouldn't. And the reason is, is because they're ripping us off. They're printing so much money to keep the stock market high, so mom and pa pop, stupid person who has a 401k or a pension, they go, oh, I don't have to worry, I got a pension. The stock market is up. And then meanwhile, gold is going up. The reason gold is going up is a common thing because they're printing trillions of dollars. Before we continue, help us by smashing that YouTube like button and subscribe now to this channel. This shows the algorithm that you value the information and it helps us spread this message. Sharing is caring. Please like and subscribe now. Thank you. And now let's continue. You cannot have both going at the same time. I hope I'm wrong, but the U.S. dollar is dead. And when it, it's got about five more years, don't get me wrong, it's still a strong currency. But gold will get stronger, so will silver, so will get, so will Bitcoin. Because of this here is the school teachers, our governments, the Treasury, Wall Street, and the banking system, the Federal Reserve Bank, are ripping us off. And that's why Rich Dad was company was formed about 25 years ago. So that's why the stock market is high, but so is gold high. It's a complete manipulation of the stock market. When I talk about commercial CMBS, it's commercial mortgage backed securities. That's no, that's 2020, they're going bust. But it was no difference to what happened in 2008 when mom and pop with no money bought a house they couldn't afford. So the difference is from 2008 till today, 2020, 
the problem only got trillions times bigger. So CNBS, CNBS that's one thing. What they are is in, in, this, in the shadow banking system. And I, I'll be talking more and more in the future about the shadow banking system. It's the banking system you cannot see. Very simple. I have a new book coming out about the shadow banking system. But anyway, so you have a CMBS, that means that shopping center down the street from you, the hotel next to you, the office building, you know, the, if you live in a big city, those buildings are broke. The owners are broke. There's another word called forbearance. Forbearance means, well, we'll, you know, we'll, we'll let you pay up, you know, you, you can catch up on your payments later on. Well, forbearance, and say, so, okay, we'll give you 30 days or 60 days. And then from forbearance comes foreclosure. So I don't know if you know this, but it also affects residential markets. So mom and pop, they don't, they don't have a CMBS, commercial mortgage backed security. They're too small. But 30% of all mom and pops are in forbearance. That means they can't afford their house. You know, when they lost their jobs due to COVID or whatever happened, they can't afford their house. So what's happening in America today is kind of a repeat of 2004, five, six, seven, eight. People are starting to flip housing because the price of housing is in serious trouble because mom and pop can't make the payments. Forbearance. So forbearance means they're asking for more time to pay the mortgage. But if they don't pay the mortgage, they go into foreclosure. So that's why so many people are, you know, the scavengers are out there buying houses for discounts for them. So a, a subprime loan and a CMBS, commercial mortgage-backed security, is the same thing, except the numbers are that much bigger. And that's why the stock market goes up, is because the Fed keeps printing as much money to keep mom and pop, and the CM, the big, the more, big mortgages paying the bills, the airlines paying the bills, PPP. They're just pumping as much money. What to do in such a situation? Inform yourself and keep your financial education strong. We from the Compact Group offer our loyal subscribers a free educational portal with first-hand monetary, financial, and economic knowledge. Enter our invite-only Insider Club by clicking the link below. You will get access to first-class information far earlier than the rest. We have prepared a special deal for all our members where you can access a giant pool of Robert Kiyosaki's financial wisdom for just $1. To find out more, simply click the link below and join our Insider Club absolutely free. But there is more you can and should do. Build up several streams of income. More and more people realize that they have to take their future in their own hands but they don't know how and where to start. We from Compact offer our Insider Club members unique opportunities. Strengthen your financial muscle and get the edge. Click the link below. Become part of our free Insider Club. No financial obligations. But there's one important thing you have to know. You have to become active. So do it now. Become active and see you on the other side.